What's going on guys? How are you guys doing today? It's your boy Crazy336 coming at you today with my MPBF Season 6 Week 11 battle against Jay Macbeth and his duck in his Orlando Magic Arts. As you can see, he brought his Magina, his Rhyferia, his Glass Score, his Mega Metacham, his uh, Malamar, and his X Splowd. As y'all know, we brought Guppy, Nigel, Bethany, Alduin, Tauros, and Bella. Otherwise known as my Mega Swampert, my Pelipper, my Lone, my Lolan Raichu, my Garchomp, my Buffalon, and my Lipod. Okay, so let's see. What, who do I want to lead here? Do I want to go ahead and try to get Rain set up? Because, like, he didn't bring any of the mods I expect to actually deal damage with Rain. Okay, so let's see. I think I'm going to lead Guppy here. And depending on who he leads, depends on, uh, makes my next move. The reason I'm going to lead Guppy is because Guppy's pretty much, if you look at Guppy's moveset, uh, Ice Punch, Stealth Rock, Earthquake, and Waterfall, I can either go straight for Stealth Rocks and try to get some damage off if he goes into, like, Exploud or, like, Malamar or something. Because I don't think either of them really do too much damage against me. Well, he could go Magina and not really do much damage to me, and he have to swap out. But if he, so, Ice Punch does good against um, crap, Glasgow, who I'm actually really worried about because I've got swept by Glasgow before in the th in my 3DS lead down moon. So I'm gonna leave a Guppy here. And see, he leaves with his Glasgow. His Glasgow is obviously gonna outspeed me, so I'm gonna go straight for Mega. I'm gonna Mega Evolve and go straight for the Ice Punch. So, as you can see, he went Earthquake, predicting me to switch out or just deal some extra damage. I went Ice Punch and almost killed him. And as you can see, it's the Poison Hill variant. So, he, it's pretty much useless at this point since I pretty much predicted that. So, he's just going to sack it off to another Ice Punch. So, Gub picks up a kill this week. Let's go! Okay, I'm so hot for my first battle back. Okay, so let's see. Mega Meta Cham, uh, let's see. What? Okay, so let's see. Let's go to Guppy on this thing. I swear to God, I thought I got rid of all this. What the crap? Uh. Is this it? Yes, this is it, I think. Okay, yes, this is it. Okay, so what is he... Okay, so what does Guppy get from going up against a Mega, uh, Metacham? Ah, shit. Metacham, Mega, all-out attacker. Okay, so ooh, that's kind of that's gonna be scary. Okay, so the bad thing is right here, guys. Okay, so let's see. He could go. Okay, so if he's an all, if he's in uh the OU all out attacker version of Mega Metachim, he's gonna have Fake Out, High Jump Kick, Ice Punch with Zen and Zen Headbutt. If this is his set, High Jump Kick will do eighty eight point six through hundred and four point eight damage. That's enough. That's even if even that low roll, that's enough to kill Guppy. So how? So let me check. Let me check out Pelipper, Nigel. Nigel uh won't get killed right off the bat. So I, I'm gonna swap from here. I'm gonna swap into Nigel. Even Ice Punch. Uh, what if he runs Thunder? If I'm pretty sure he's not gonna bring Thunder Punch. If but if he does. Thunder Punch. Thunder, I know good. I know good. Yeah, if he has Thunder Punch and predicts to swap out into Pelipper, then Pelipper's dead. But I'm going to risk that. And I'm going to go into Bethany. And not Bethany. Nigel predicting the high jump kick. Rain comes up. He and Mega Evolves and goes for the fake out. Try, oh, true. Okay, so now, Her if he's an OU all out attacker, Hurricane should kill him at. No matter what. I have a... I have... It's a... Okay, so Hurricane from... But Nigel said, if he's the OU all-out attacker... Uh, let's see. Hurricane would do 103.4 through 122.6 damage here. And Hurricane is bound to hit. 
Uh, let's see. Okay, I'm gonna go. F I'm going straight for Hurricane here. He swapped out into X Plowed. X Plowed took 40 damage. Okay, wait a second. Nope. It's, don't they? Doesn't they? Do they? Okay, no, they don't have rocks up. Okay, so now let's go check out um, X Plowed. I'm just gonna go in you wall breakers do that. Okay, so if he's the X Bloud in you wall breaker set, ooh, he could go boom bust and instantly get the kill, like no matter what I do. Let's say I go into Guppy. Oh, not Guppy, um, who do I have? Okay, so Alduin. What about Alduin? Let's let this thing catch up, because it's being slow as hell. Boom bust oh, still almost killed a second. What about Z. This thing is scary. I need to get it out of the, out of the field as quickly as possible. Okay, so if I can if I can get into Guppy, not not Guppy, um, Alduin here, and get off a Z Tectonic Rage. What does he have? Does he have anything on his team that can? Nothing that won't die to it. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna swap into Alduin here. He went boom bust, which is what I fully predicted. Okay, so now I, uh, he should not be able to outspeed unless he's choice scarfed, which I don't think he will. Let me pull up calculator real quick. I really hope he's done. He's not, because that did about that did about no more range for the NU Wallbreaker set. Oh sh! Okay, so he might be. Okay, so he might be choice specs. He has to be choice specs for that. So he's stuck in the boom bust. So I'm definitely going for Z Tectonic Rage here, and it and it lands. And x is dead. Let's go. Let's go. Well, wait, that a boy out to win. Okay, so Malamar is here. Uh, Malamar is definitely not going to outspeed me. So what would be my best bet to go in against Malamar here? Unless Malamar is... I kind of want... Okay, so let's see if he's contrary rest talk. Okay, so I'm not... Z move anymore. I lost my Z move. So let's see. My best bet would be to go for Earthquake again. Cause yeah, if okay, so base okay, so even if this thing's two fifty two. Let me pull up calculate. I thought I already did that. Calculator. Okay, so let's see. He's at two forty five. Two forty five. Multiply by one point five. He would be at three if he if okay, so if Malamar is at max health right um not max health, max speed with choice cough, he'll be able to outspeed me. But, okay, I think it's a good, I think, cause I'm thinking I'm just going to go for like Earthquake here and try to get some chip damage off on him. Okay, so he's, he's choice, he's choice scarfed. But that, yeah, he's, he's choice scarfed contrary. Okay, so now that I don't have to worry about them, let me go to... Mega Swamp of Guppy. Okay, so nothing. Okay, so now this thing's gonna be kind of a dangerous threat to my team. So, okay, so he has. Okay, so he has, but he has one attack. And one defense, right? Yeah, one attack and one defense. Since he's contrary. Let's see. What would be my best bet to go into here? Cause okay, so superpower won't do a bunch, but if he goes super, if he if he's choice scarfed, which I, he has to be, that is the only way he can outspeed Garchomp. Okay, so Guppy should be. Uh, let me put Rain up. So Mega Swamp should be able to outspeed and get some damage off on him. Okay, I'm gonna. Okay, my bet, my best bet to go right now, is to go into Guppy and try to get some damage off with Earthquake or not Earthquake Waterfall. Okay, so I'm off. Okay, so I'm obviously gonna outspeed him. So I'm gonna go Waterfall here, and if I can't, hopefully Waterfall will be able to get the flinch. Yes, let's go to get the flinch. Waterfall again. Definitely. Let's go.
Okay, I think I'm going to... Okay, so for here... Okay, so I know that going into... um. But staying in the guppy is kind of risky. I need to drive, I need him. I need guppy to stay alive. So what I'm gonna. And I don't want to send out Nigel because fake out is another. It's more chip damage off on Nigel. And so I'm gonna switch. I'm gonna swap into Bethany here. Okay, so fake out did. Ooh, that was a bunch. I'm gonna go. Uh, I'm gonna go volt switch here. Even. Okay, so I know I'm gonna outspeed this thing. I know that good and well. But I'm stuck into this. So I'm gonna swap into. Ooh, what do I swap into? <laughs> okay, he went earthquake. Okay, so what? His best bet would be go back into Gina. Okay, so what is McGinna weak to again? McGinna. <clears throat> McGinna is weak to fire and ground only. Okay, so I know self here will kill this thing. So his best bet right now <clears throat> I really go into McGinna. Say he's OU assault vest. I uh, not Okay, so if I can get some chip damage off on McGinna with Pelipper. Let me find him again. Pelipper, where the hell'd you go? Nigel oh there you are. It's Okay, so surf's my best bet, so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go into surf here. Let me also check to see how much damage surf would do on the meta champ. If he's the OU all out, uh, Mega Metacham OU all out attacker. Okay, so I'm gonna go Surf here to be safe, cause Surf's my best bet and I'll do the most damage against it. Cause I know he's not. Oh, he stayed in with Rhyferia. He went Avalanche too, and I. Ooh, I. No, no, I didn't do. I didn't do as much as I hoped. Okay, so wait a second. How much? Okay, so let's see how much Hurricane does. I'm gonna go Roost here. Wait, should I go roost? Nah, uh, yeah, no. Okay, I just want to kill. Okay, I'm gonna kill this thing. I'm gonna go surf right here. Okay, so how much did uh fake out do against this thing? Fake out. Okay, so that was against a lone and right tree, though. I bet, okay, I'm just gonna go hurricane here. I know gonna where he's gonna go, um. Whatchamacallit? Fake out here. Fake out did some chip damage. Uh, do I wanna save. Do I wanna save Nigel? That's the, that's the question. Do I want to save Nigel? Go hurricane here. Bullet punch doesn't do anything, but. My, that's GG. I can swap from here. I can swap into um, uh, Mega sw uh, Guppy right here and get some extra really bad damage off on him. Okay, so let's go. I just want to be sure how much. Okay, so I kind of just want to keep Pelipper in real quick and try to. Uh, not this. Let's go down and find my Guppy. Mega Swamper, Swamper, Mega Guppy. Okay, so, okay, so let's see. Not this. Not against Meta Mega Metacham. Let's go into. No, 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 no. Again, uh, OU Assault Vest. Okay, so let's see. Okay, so if I swap into Guppy here, and he goes for like Floor Cannon or Iron Head or something, Guppy will more than likely take a huge hit. Is at 59.9. It can survive a floor cannon, definitely. Def okay, if it definitely has so hard, it can definitely survive a floor cannon. But only got one chance to hit an earthquake. Earthquake, and I don't really don't want to do that. So I'm going to stay in and go surf. 
try to get some chip damage off on it. Okay. Okay, so I think he was expecting me to swap out. But I can go in now with Guppy and get the Earthquake off, and that's GG. Because Guppy's definitely going to outspeed, even with Twinkle Tack, even with that Twinkle Tackle. I'm sorry, Nigel, but I had to set. I'm sorry, Nigel, but I had to sack you to get this win. Okay, so all I have to do is wait, 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 wait. wait. Okay, so, yeah, that's GG. That was a that was a good game to uh, Jay. He was a uh, that did that actually did really good. I'm kind of curious to what his um set was for Magina. I'm pretty sure I think my prediction game was just like a lot better than what his was. Like I predict like uh, Guppy was pretty much a really good bring into his whole team in my opinion. How many kills did it pick up this week? I gotta I gotta watch that. I'm gonna watch that back and see how many kills uh, Guppy got. One. Two. Three. Guppy got three kills this week. That is amazing. And I think if I'm right, Guppy got three, Nigel got two. Two and outer and get one. That was amazing, but okay. So Guppy got three, so he get so add three to his kill list. Nigel got one. Uh, no, Nigel got two, but died once, so add one to his kill list. And Alduin got one, but died, so he didn't get anything from this week. Well, guys, that was my battle for this week. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a like down the co leave a like down below and com and also comment. What you thought I could have done better. What all could have happened. That's about it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And 